Hello there, this is Bob Amidon on the Bob Amidon channel uh, on uh, October 1st. Today is October 1st, 2020. Uh, I play GeoGuessr and just post videos of that because I like it. Uh, that's what I'm about. That's what this channel is about. Uh, if you've watched my other videos, you might notice I've rearranged some things on my desk. So there's a different angle on me, but it's uh, the same old... Uh, same old money shot here of uh, GeoGuessr. Uh, I just played a, a country streak game, which is that new feature on GeoGuessr where you just have to pick the country right, but get it as many times in a row as possible. I got 16 in a row this last time. I made the mistake I've made before of not being sure if it was a Greek alphabet or a uh, uh, Cyrillic alphabet. Um, I was, uh, I thought it was Greek, but I guess it was Cyrillic really. Didn't, I thought I saw some Greek characters, but nope, wasn't even near Greece. Anyway, um, I'm just going to do another normal. Oh, here's another real quick fact. I think you can play the country streak version of the game for free. Like anybody with a free account can do it. So that's neat. You should try it out. It's fun. Um, but I'm going to do a, um, what am I even going to do? I don't know. Uh, let's just do, uh, huh. let's do, didn't I do this a bunch and do okay on it? I don't even remember. Uh, what do they say about it? Lots of locations, not so much with the U S and Russia and Brazil. Yeah. Okay. Let's try it. I think I remember it's kind of hard. It says moderate, but whatever. I'm going to do five minute time limits and I'm going to, uh, post the link so that you can play the same game. So that means this game I'm about to play, uh, you can click the link in the comments and you can play it. Maybe play it before you watch my video and then see if you uh, how, how you compare. So I do that by saving this link and putting it over here. Um, and start. Okay, Cyrillic alphabet, not Greek, Cyrillic. Um, I don't like it. It's hard. <laughs> they did promise not too much with the Russia. So maybe this is not Russia. Maybe it's one of the other countries that uses the Cyrillic alphabet. There are several. Uh, let's figure out which one it is. Um, I don't see, oh, dot RU. Maybe we are in Russia. Should we guess that? Oh, wait, no, this isn't country streak. This is exactly, this is guess exactly where game. Sorry, I just played the country streak, so uh, I'm a little messed up in my brain. The problem is, though, if we're in Russia, it's very hard to get it close, for me anyway. Uh, I don't uh, distinguish between parts of Russia very well. We're totally in Russia. Um, they all kind of look the same to me. <laughs> Sorry, uh, and I can't read the Cyrillic uh, to know any like names of place. I can sort of try to spot it in the, just by the shapes of the words. Doesn't it feel like we're awkwardly hugging this side and I want to see what's over here and I can't get over there? Isn't that frustrating? Oh, okay, wait, now we are closer to there. But what does any of this tell me? I don't know. I would love to see some road markers. Um I'm not going to do well in this round, this. So if you're playing along, this is a chance for you to kick my ass. Um, what is going on? The clicking is obnoxious. I uh, uh, wonder what this area tells me. What do you tell me? Seems like a uh, major commercial hub. Are we in Moscow? I mean, I guess I'll guess we're in Moscow. I have been to St. Petersburg, as I've mentioned. Um, and so... I mean, this doesn't look much like what I've seen of St. Petersburg for what that's worth. Um, you know what it looks a little like? One time we played a few videos. This was on my recording. You know, I guessed, um, I think I guessed Moscow and it was Vladivostok or I guessed way to the west and it was Vladivostok, which is way to the east. The thing is, this looks a little like that place. So I could risk it and guess we're in Vladivostok just based on it looking a little removed from Moscow. Uh, the problem is that is so far to the east that it's a big point risk. Whoa! Ah! Why is this even happening? Uh, you guys, I think we're screwed. I think, uh, I think it broke. 
Okay, it unbroke. Um, but now it's like this. What's going on? I don't know. Maybe it's my internet. Maybe it's whatever other forces are afoot here in GeoGuessr. Maybe it's GeoGuessr. Maybe it's Google. I don't know. Um, but what I was getting at is maybe I should guess Vladivostok. But that's a big risk because um, it's so far east. Look at this. Look at this. What is this doing to me? Ugh. I'm not going to have much patience for this. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just guess Vladivostok because I want to have fun with my life. That's down here. <laughs> I'm going to guess Vladivostok some sort of way. Hang on. What direction even are we? I don't know. I'm just going to go here and see how that goes. <laughs> uh, boom, boom. Let's just do it. Nope. It was not Vladivostok. It was Novos, uh, no, not of a severe. It's something I hadn't heard of. Uh, Nov I can't even read the whole thing. Novokuznetsk. Like I would have gotten that. So uh, I got almost no points and my uh, shame is boundless. Let's move on to this place. Uh, it doesn't look like a national flag to me. Um, looks something uh, Eastern or Northern European. Ooh, they got a nice pretty bo body of water up there maybe. Uh, looks like a Scandinavian language, Bergnaset, but which Scandinavian language? Um, is it Denmark? Are we in Denmark? Um, let's see. Uh, why do I say Denmark? I just have just something about those place names there feels a little more Danish than Swedish or Norwegian, but I might be wrong. I do have a nice body of water there to look at. Uh, let's look at what this sign says. Hopefully it says then road name, number, or whatever of this. Okay, so this is all about how if you go straight, you go to Herzang or whatever, but that way is to Smedjan and Karpen and parking for those places. Um, uh, that is to the south. Uh, so let's look in the part of Denmark where there'd be a South coast, like here, is there a Hertzen over there? Hertzen? Do you see that? I don't. Um, what about here? Hertzen? Hertzen? I might be wrong about Denmark. Maybe we're talking more like Norway. Maybe there's a Hertzen over here. Uh, or maybe that's not a, as big a body of water as the Baltic Sea or whatever. Sure looks like it goes a long way that way, though. Uh, I got three minutes left. Come on, give me uh, give me another hint. Is that a hint? If so, it's lost on me. Uh, uh, we're on a little frontage road now, aren't we? I wanted to be out here and really just take a big trip. Whoa, where? what happened? What happened? Are there signs over here? Teach me where we are. Maybe that van knows. Ah, uh, ah! Clicking is not cooperating. Where was that van that had words on it? I don't know. Another sign, though, but is it going to be? Oh, okay. Nora Hamen. Hertzen, Centrum. Nora Hamen. Is that a Denmark thing? Nora Hamen. Universität. Um... I need more. I need more. Um, nah. Tell me words. Tell me. Show me words. Show me places. Road name would be great right now, you guys. What are those? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Why did that happen? Oh, look at that. Is this Denver or is this Finland with words like that? Two U's and then two D's? That's nuts. Should we look around Finland? They definitely have a lot of south coast in Finland. Um, hmm. I don't know. Uh, I think I would really like to see if this bus talks about a country. That's what I would really like. Uh, we only have a minute and a half left. Talk about a country. Dot S-E. So Sweden. Um, I didn't really look around Sweden yet, did I? Did I? Uh, okay. I'm guessing Sweden, though. Um, what about 
Where in Sweden? Uh, got a minute left. I'm just looking for some of those places we've seen talked about. Like for, well, maybe we should see what's on this side going this way. Uh, Oskarsvarv and, uh, okay, E4, E4S. Where's that? Where's that going to be? Is it going to be around here? E4, are we around here? E4 uh, does a lot of work throughout Sweden, apparently, uh, showing us all sorts of different kinds of parts of it. Goes over here. But where is this current part of it? Goes up here. Are you seeing any of the same words, you guys? Where are we? Which part of Sweden are we in? Are we in John Koping? No, we're not. Um, just looking for some of those same places. And if I don't find them, I don't know. Guess I blew it. Uh, at least I figured out the country. So, oh my God, it was way off. <laughs> Look at that. It was way up here. It didn't seem like the E4 kept going, but uh, we were in Lulea. Didn't even see that anywhere. Uh, I don't I don't think I saw any of these names of places. Huh. But uh, this is the body of water we looked south upon. Interesting. All right. You guys really have a shot at doing better than me on this game. Uh, so congratulations in advance on um, making me look like a chump. What does that say? Uh, something about Piedra Buena. What does this say, though? This seems more gooder. Um Jardin Patagonico de las Rosas. So are we in Patagonia? What part of Patagonia? It's a rather big place. It's this whole chunk of South America. Uh, but what about you? Gomeria. Does it feel like Chile? Does it feel like a little bit Southern Chile to you guys? It sort of feels like that to me. Like we're a little away from where the cities are big anymore. It's so far south. Uh, Tres Lagos. I think I've seen a Tres Lagos before. Um, and I, I think I had trouble finding it. 3 and 288. Do you see those? 3 and 288. I think down here there's a 3 and a 288. Uh, are we in Argentina after all? Here's a 3 in Argentina. Uh, yeah. And 288. Are we here? Can't be that easy. Rio Gallegos is down there. Uh, Tres Lagos is there. So you know what? We're right here, aren't we? Huh, look at that. Uh, I did pretty well, I think. Um, so let's try to really zero in. Are we like here? Um, let's look at what these places... I mean, there's this roundabout. I should be able to find the roundabout if I'm... Uh, wait a minute. This sign told us where everything is. So if we want to find out where three is, we got to, it's either this way. It's telling us this is the three. Uh, and also if you, it's telling the driver to go th that way. To the, so this is the three. It's saying that this is the three, right? Right. It's a weird thing, but that's what it's telling us. Going south right now. Um, where is this part of the three? It seems like it's here. It seems like it's one of the... It's, like, we're right here. I think I'm on it because this is the 288, right? So if you're going north and you come to this funky roundabout, maybe it's this roundabout. Is the Hotel Rio Santa Cruz over here? Um... It would be over here, right? Uh, is that Avenido? Okay, I don't know. Okay. Um, now that's starting to give me different information. Um, what's that thing over there? If I'm right about that, then that's a thing. Is that a YPF? It is a YPF. Okay, this is correct. Yeah, look at that. It's 90 meters away. Uh, all right, I did much better that time. Um, now we're in maybe America or Canada. 
four-way stop sign. Just looks like an American suburb to me, American or Canadian. I live in a, an American herb, not suburb, but plenty of suburbs near me. Um, Ninth Avenue, Ninth Street, okay, or Main Street. Is that Main Street? Well, if we're on Main Street, we'll probably figure it out pretty quick, right? Uh, what place are we in? Uh, downtown, there's golf. Driving on the right, so that backs up my suspicion of America or Canada. Backs it up, doesn't totally confirm it. It just adds to my Scotiabank, Canada. We're in Canada, Petro Canada. We are in Canada. We're not in my home country of the United States. I can't get exactly where I want to go. But this is talking about 5 West. And for some reason, I can't get a good angle on it because <laughs> we're way over here. Um, 5 West. I don't know. That doesn't really help. Um, 8th Avenue, Highway 5, Glen Hall Drive. Okay. I mean, Scotiabank doesn't mean we're in Nova Scotia. Nova Sc it would be nice to narrow it down to that, but Nova Scotia is one of the provinces, and there are a bunch, and um, Scotiabank is in other parts of the of the uh, country as well. So let's just look for more clues. We have three minutes. Um. We're just in some town in this province or territory. Maybe we're in a territory. Maybe this is Yukon. I don't know. Saskatoon. We are in Saskatchewan. We are in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. That's where we are. And we are at 8th and Main. <laughs> um, 33, 35. We're down here, aren't we? Um. 8th Street and where's Main? We started at 9th, right? Well, there's Main. Wait a minute. Was it 9th Avenue? Not Street. Now I'm looking at Street. Okay, where's 9th Avenue then? Uh, what can Main tell me about 9th Avenue? Huh? Am I wrong about us being in Saskatoon? I mean, that's pretty damning right there. We got to be in Saskatoon. So let's go back to here. Uh, and figure out again what exactly this intersection was. Doesn't tell. It's a secret. Nobody gets to know what streets these are. Uh, why are some places so stingy about that? So let's just keep going. What did we do before? Uh, let's go this way. Does this one have street signs? Yeah, this one does. This is, and we're uh, going east here so we're one block east of where we started it's 10th street 9th avenue 10th street 9th avenue 9th there's 10th street right is this 10th street doesn't even bother telling me um hmm still got a minute left are we over here 12th 11th why is 10th street a secret why doesn't anyone want to admit to being 10th Street? Now we're talking about letters. Am I just completely barking up the wrong tree? There's 10th Street. Okay. It's on the other side of Maine. But what about 11th or 9th Avenue? What about that? Why are you being weird about that, Saskatoon? Where's 9th Avenue, huh? 10th Street, 9th Avenue. Come on, man. We got this. Where's 9th Avenue? I don't see any avenues, 9th Avenue type things. That's why I'm like, maybe it was a trick, a dirty trick to make me think I was in Saskatoon, but really I'm not because I don't see a 10th Street intersecting with any such thing as a 9th Avenue. So what am I going to do? I don't know. I'm just going to guess there. <laughs> no, it wasn't in Saskatoon. That's the problem. Even though that thing would totally made it look like it's the Saskatoon branch of a whatever, it's Humboldt, Saskatchewan. 103 kilometers away. I mean, I could do worse. I could do worse. Um, but I uh, 
didn't do better. No question about that. All right. Next round. Um, pretty hills over there. Nice little monument over here, which has a person that is special to this community. Um, what community is it? We've got 40% off some shoes. This community uh, doesn't look so much like the uh, English speaking place where I live. Looks like it could be La Paz, La Paz, Bolivia. There are other La Paz's though, so don't go jumping all over this thinking, oh, we're definitely in La Paz, Bolivia, because there are other La Paz's. But this makes it seem like San Miguel is a part of the La Paz we're in. Do you see a San Miguel? Do you guys see a San Miguel here? Like maybe that's a district or a borough or something. I sure don't. So let's look around some more. Um, hey there, buddy. And it is kind of mountainsy, so I bet it uh, seems likely that we're in La Paz, Bolivia. Looks like a nice day to be in La Paz, Bolivia, doesn't it? Um, um, okay, all right. Uh, just surrounded by mountains here, aren't we? Just a lovely little valley. Okay, all right. Are you a bus of the city of La Paz, Bolivia? How Bolivian are you, bus? Um, where should we look? This way? Should we keep going this way? See some signs, some billboards. Just some liveliness. Just some life. You know, there's just some life around here. Ooh, what's this sign? Uh, okay. Yeah, you can't help me. You're covered by a tree. And that's not just... Google Street View people that are frustrated by that. All the drivers can't see what that sign says. Bolivia, send someone out with some sh pruning shears. Um, okay, Ave Bal something. Bo Bolivian? Is it Ave Avenida Bolivian? Uh, I can't quite tell. Everything is just so half-assed in this place, but it's pretty. All right, Hunter Bus, Diplomatico. Uh, those are the colors of the Bolivian flag, although there's a thing on it. Um, there's a thing here on the Bolivian flag that isn't there. That's Peru. That's Brazil. That's Argentina. What are you doing to me? La Paz could be in Argentina. So, how do we figure it out? We still have two minutes. Uh, that's a Bolivia thing. I think we're in La Paz, Bolivia. Uh, and I wonder where, though. It's a pretty big city. Um, we need to know where we are in La Paz. This is Avenida Bolivian. And that is a east-west sort of Avenida. But in what part of town? Look at all this. What powder town is it in? I mean, I mean, right now we're heading to the west towards some mountains. So are we like here? Huh? I got a minute 15 left. Give me something else to go by. I mean, we're approximately there, right? Okay, what's this? Uh. Uh, what are you telling me? Well, this isn't a very big, let's look for another big intersection. Another big road that this intersect, oh, did I pass by all the good stuff? Whoa, we sort of curved to the north. Where does the an avenue do that here, huh? Oh, no, no, no. Hmm. Curves to the north. Now we're just going north. And it's got just mountains over there and we're curving to the north. It's all very, very exciting. Where do you think we are? I think we're here. We're running out of time. Feel like I might have to just oh no because we're hang on hang on 
Why don't you wait for me? I'm just saying, hang on. I think we're just going to guess that. Well, it was the other side of town, nine kilometers away. This is where we were. Guess this is where it was curving to the north. Huh. We would have hit, wait, no, we were on this, and then it did this. This is where it curved to the north. And we were on Ave Roma. Yeah, so that's it. That's game. How did I do? 17,551 points. Those first two rounds were junk. Look at that. Look at that. I mean, I got the country right, and yet so far away. Country right, yet so far away. The other three I did respectable, I think. I think I did respectably on those other three. Where are they? I don't even remember. Where was, I don't know. But I bet you can do better. I bet you can, and I hope you will try and you will show me. Thanks for watching. There you are. I moved you. Thanks for watching.